Welcome to this uh, Windows channel and um, I wanted to uh, share a, a little bit of observations of things that have been uh, modified with the last cumulative update that uh, we received last week. Um, I did get some reports by the way of a few people saying that they've had a few problems installing it and uh, but it seems that when you install it manually it actually works but also I did see that if you use the um, you know fix it feature in, in Windows 10 to, uh, to fix Windows Update, it actually fixes and installs correctly. But uh, one of the things, you know, that uh, is uh, actually a couple of things with the Windows Defender that they did tweak that I like is first of all, now you can double click to get Defender to open. I, I can't even understand that they let that one go by because I can't believe that it was so difficult to do a double click on just the Windows Defender to have it open. Um, looks more like something they forgot to do than something that they didn't do. Um, and also the um, fact that when your computer is plugged in, the device and performance health actually reports no issues with my battery. Um, it stopped annoying me with battery, battery, battery all the time. Also, the, the device driver issue is not there anymore. Apparently that was a bug, not a real problem. So, um, you know, when we, we see these cumulative updates that actually fix bugs and fix things, well, one of the, the, the a couple of things that they fixed that's, that's visual and that we, we can actually see is the Windows Defender here. So I think it's nice that they fixed that device driver bug, but also I think it's nice that they actually stop annoying you. You know, I understand if I'm on battery, you know, I'm, and I guess, I don't know, let me uh, just unplug my power here. I don't know if it can annoy me immediately or not but it's, it doesn't seem to annoy me right now um, but at least you know telling me that my screen is a hundred percent and it's gonna affect battery life of course that should not be while I'm um, you know <laughs> plugged in because of course when you're plugged in it has you know you have no problem there you're not using the battery um, so I don't know how long it takes to actually tell me issues or anything, but anyways. A few things that are fixed here in the Defender. Um, Antivirus and um, also another thing that it did fix that's kind of not a visible thing. Apparently when you were scanning with the Windows Defender, sometimes it could hang a little bit on some of the files a little long. From what uh, uh, someone had told me is that apparently that is also a little thing they fixed in here. Uh, meaning that when they actually scan your hard drive for something and um, they they actually will now see that um, it will not now not you know stall on some of the files in your hard drive uh, apparently that was a little something it wasn't um, you know it didn't prevent your scan or anything but it apparently could make the scan a little longer so uh, that's why it was like that but uh, that apparently is also another thing that's fixed. So uh, multiple little things in Windows Defender. And you know, uh, for, it's funny because when you look at the blog post of the cumulative update, I have the impression that they gave out the, the main you know, ideas behind what was fixed, but not necessarily everything and every little detail that was fixed. So uh, these are some of the observations that I, I personally had and also um, a little more that I've learned about. Uh, concerning the Windows Defender. So now you can double click and it is less annoying in telling you different things. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.